We present Avatar, an augmented reality environment for analysing recordings of human motion data to gain insights into how humans utilise and interact with their surrounding environment. We combine head-mounted augmented reality with a tablet device to display and manipulate in situ visualisations of time-varying motion data directly in the environment in which it was recorded. The visualisations are centred around humanoid avatars, showing people's detailed movement. Additionally, we use 3D trajectories and visualizations embedded into the environment to offer insights into how people occupy and interact with their environment. Using recorded or motion captured joint positions, we generate a virtual humanoid representation that reconstructs the posture of a person. We include detailed positions of hand and head movement. This representation allows insights into a person's behavior beyond more abstract visualizations, such as trajectories. Avatars visualise a person's position and posture at a given point in time within the dataset. The time can be manipulated either by dragging the avatar's torso using mid-air interaction or by activating the playback mode by performing an air tap. Time can be either manipulated for all avatars synchronously or for each avatar separately. By performing an air tap and hold on a body part, a radial menu provides access to a set of visualisations specific to each body part. For example, the gaze visualisation can be accessed by interacting with a person's head, while the touch visualisation is available at the hands. 3D trajectories encode the past and future movement of each person, and are presented as continuous tubes, colour-coded in the corresponding avatar's colour. The length of the trajectory can be manipulated to different users' needs, for example to show only past time frames, or to show several minutes into the future. The length can also be set to infinity to visualise the whole data set. The system supports trajectories for different body parts of a person, such as hand or head, enabling analysis of each individually. Ghost previews. To provide a mechanism to assess and compare posture changes over time, we develop the ghost trajectory. When a user looks at a point along the trajectory, a semi-transparent representation of the avatar's posture at that time is shown. Ghost previews can also be utilised for the trajectories of individual body parts. For example, looking at the head of a person shows how the hands moved around in the environment. Ghost previews can be pinned by performing a double air tap. This fixes them in place to be used for comparison with other points in time. Spectre trails. Spectre trails combine the momentary details provided by the avatar with the summarising overview of a trajectory. Semi-transparent representations of the avatars are rendered at configurable intervals into past and future. The overall length can be configured in the same way as the trajectories, by interacting with the endpoints. When used for specific body parts, only spectres of those parts are shown. We further embedded visualisations directly into the environment. Gaze visualisations provide insights into a person's visual attention by placing coloured markers at their viewing locations in the environment. Gaze visualisations are coloured with a gradient, with the centre being opaque and getting more transparent towards the border, indicating central and peripheral vision. The gaze visualisation provides an estimate of what a person can see from their current position, as well as an indication of their visual focus. Touch interactions. Avatar shows where a person interacted with the surface by placing markers at positions where their hands interacted with the environment. By pointing at them, Markers can be selected to show the time the touch occurred. By tapping the marker, playback time jumps to this point. Markers are colour-coded for each avatar. Footprint and heat map visualisations help to understand how people moved around the environment. Heat maps convey a general understanding of how populated an area was. Footstep visualisations provide insights of precisely where a person's feet touch the ground. Clustering of footsteps indicates where people remain stationary or which areas have seen lots of movement. Tablet view. Avatar utilises the tablet device as a control interface, in addition to mid-air gestures in AR. The tablet provides an overview of the environment on a 2D floor plan, showing 2D trajectories and the current positions of avatars in the playback. A lasso selection allows the selection of specific avatars, thereby filtering the data. Through control view, the current playback time for individual avatars can be manipulated, and specific visualisations or avatars can be toggled on or off. In summary, with Avatar, we present an immersive visualisation environment for the in-situ analysis of human motion data. Using avatars, trajectories, 
and environmental visualizations, we make data not only explorable, but experienceable.